Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. The role of Egypt in building human civilization. All praise is due to Allah, the Lord of all worlds, who says in his ever glorious book, Welcome to Egypt. You will be saved here. I bear witness that there is no God but Allah, and that Muhammad is his servant and messenger. May Allah's peace and blessing be upon him, his household, companion, and upon those who follow their path to the Day of Judgment. Our beloved homeland, Egypt, the cradle of civilizations, the home of divine messages, and the, thri the thriving hearts of Arab and Islam. It is a country whose name is mentioned in the glorious Quran, as the Almighty Allah says in the words of the Prophet Joseph, Peace be upon him. Welcome to Egypt, you will be saved here. He who has seen the earth and its countries, and people of all types and races, but never saw Egypt or its people, so he has not seen the world or the people. Our homeland Egypt is a country of treasures and the blessing. The Almighty Allah has, has described in its word, of Prophet Joseph saying, Put me in a charge of the storehouse of the land, for I'm truly reliable. And on the blessed land of Sinai, Allah Almighty spoke to Moses. In addition, the father of the prophets, Abraham, peace be upon him, married our mother Hajar. He was from Egypt. And she became the mother of the prophet Ishmael, peace be upon him who is the grandfather of our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam commanded believers to be good with Egypt and its people. As he, peace be upon him, said, You will soon enter Egypt, where al qurat is frequently mentioned, so treat its inhabitants well, for there lies upon you the responsibility because of the blood ties or rel and relationship with them. Egypt is the mother of human civilization. Egypt is the land of human civilizations. Many civilizations have met on its land throughout ages. Pharaonic, Greek, Roman, Coptic, and also Islamic civilization. Islamic civilization have blessed the people of, of Egypt with a special combination of great civilization. Throughout history, people of Egypt have been char characterized. Throughout history, people of Egypt have been characterized by love, fr fraternity, generosity, and tolerance. People of Egypt have mixed together into one solid fabric throughout history and different cultures. Egypt has established its civilization and values and ethics. I would believe that the civilization built on anything other than values, ethics, and tolerance bear the factors of their fall within their construction and foundations. Egypt founded a great civilization that benefited humanity in a various sciences and arts. Egyptians have made great contributions in the field of science and knowledge over history. They have excelled in the fields of medicine, engineering, astronomy, mummification, agriculture, and construction. Throughout the ages, Egyptians have been markers of civilizations. Egyptians have been markers of civilizations. These are the pyramids standing as one of the seven wonders of the world, as a great witness to Egypt's great civilization. Egypt has enriched human civilization with a science and knowledge. Since the dawn of humanity, Prophet Idris, peace be upon him, was an Egyptian. Our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said about him 
the first to write a pen, to write with a pen. And Minyawi, may, may, Allah have, may Allah have mercy on him, said in Faidul Qadir, Prophet Idris, peace be upon him, was the first to write and study Arthism. He said, he's the first to sew and wear clothes. It was not only Prophet Idris, peace be upon him, Many Egyptians have excelled in many fields in the past and recent times. All praise is due to Allah, the Lord of all worlds. May Allah's peace and blessing be upon Prophet Muhammad wasallam, his companions and followers. When one contemplates human history, he understands that Egypt was a resort for the world in a danger and famine. Prophet Joseph, peace be upon him, developed a plan to save many neighbors' countries from a famine that afflicted them at that time. He made a balance between a hard work, perfect production, rational, consume, 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 rational consumption, and careful saving. The country could achieve prosperity, success, and culture and economic strength. People come to Egypt from every, remote, from every place to get a provision. The glorious Quran reported this story in the word of the Prophet Joseph is an interpretation of this vision of the king of Egypt. As the Almighty Allah said, you will sow for seven, consect, seven years as usual. Store all that you reap left in the ear, apart from the little you eat. After this will come seven years of hardship, which will consume all but a little of what you stored up for them. After that will come a year when the people will have abundant year, rain and will press crops. Those people who felt fear used to resort to Egypt. Moreover, in its great history, Egypt represented great resistance to rebel dangers and enemies. He would attack it, its security, its neighborhood, or its region. Throughout long history, Egypt has, has had a great impact of a human civilization. And even now, Egypt is the new republic, fascinated whole world with shining energy, driving force, the will of its leadership, the termination of its people and the effort in building and reconstruction, and encountering tourism and extremist thoughts, and its attempt to counter the effect of the climate change. Egypt has been able to bring together top world leaders on its land to work on radical solutions to address the serious effect of a climate change. Egypt has sent a call to the whole world that come to work together. Come to work together for the benefit of all humanity within the framework of the unity of a common human destiny in the universe. We ask Allah to protect our country Egypt and all other countries of the world. Thank you.